What's going on, you Nunavutian Ice Climbers? Slash Buddy24 here, bringing you my third and probably final trophy guide in Uncharted 2 Among Thieves, the PS4 remastered version as part of the Nathan Drake collection. So, um, in this trophy guide, we'll be going through the Bullet Train from Hell trophy. And this is the third and last of the sort of timed mission trophies in the game. For this trophy, you need to beat Chapter 13, Locomotion, in less than 7 minutes. Um, this is definitely the easiest of the three, which is probably why it's a bronze trophy. Um, it really doesn't even need a trophy guide because it's pretty simple, actually. But I figured since I did the other two ones, I'd just do this one. So yeah, this one really shouldn't cause you uh, any trouble at all. There's really no major sections you need to pay attention to. Um, you're just really on a train and you need to run as fast as possible. But regardless, I hope this video helps, so enjoy. Alright, so just uh, like really similar to my other two trophy guides I did for Uncharted 2. Um, I did sort of like a test run thing for this chapter. Um, I ended up getting 9 minutes, which is 2 minutes more than what you need. But granted, that was with me like literally just stopping like a lot. Because I was like really scared that I would have gotten it like on accident. I really could have just tried it. I don't know why I'm even doing test runs. You can really just try it um, for this one. Just like your first try, just go for it. There really isn't any like important parts or uh, notable things. It's really just you're hopping from car to car, run as fast as possible. And there's a, there's a helicopter that comes near the end of it, but like on easy, it literally will never hit you. So it's it's really not, um, compared to the other two, it's it's much easier. I'd say it's probably the easiest of the, of the three. But anyways, I will uh, start it here. And there's also a long cutscene, like, uh, um, in the beginning of the level, so I'm gonna cut that out. The cutscene right here, I'm gonna cut it out. Alright, so we are back now. Actually gonna start this thing. Um, yeah, it's really, uh, for this, it's really, like, not a whole lot of important seconds. You literally just have to haul ass as fast as you can. There's no, like, uh, there isn't even that many guys either. It's just a matter of jumping and running as fast as possible. There isn't any even like juggernaut guys or like dudes with big machine guns that you really need to deal with. Um, for this specific chapter it's honestly pretty easily, pretty easy I should say, not easily. Um, it's just there's like a helicopter that'll come but on, on a lower difficulty like you're not gonna have any problems. Make sure you grab uh, this stuff here though because you'll definitely need some weapons. And yeah, I'm basically just gonna uh, do this as quick as I can. You can honestly just shoot your way through it. There's not very many hard enemies or anything. <laughs> All the enemies are, are pretty weak for this section. Sorry, boys. Just needed to punch your tickets. And then right up here, make sure you uh, kill this guy. <laughs> Forgot about him, actually. And then, um, don't go through this door, just go out this window, because you have to. There'll also be parts where, like, these little, like, uh, train, um, I don't know what they're called, rail railroad crossing signal things come, and, like, if you hit them, they can kill you, but it's not, uh, like, it's, it's not, <laughs> it's not really a big deal. It's not gonna cause you any kind of trouble. Alright, so I'm just gonna, uh, blow through these guys here. There is a machine gun here, but again, um, it's not really a big deal. You can you just go above it. That's really all all there is to it. I think I almost did. I almost die there. I don't know. See, like the guy's literally dying one shot. Like, yeah, okay, I did fall there, but not a big deal. Just climb up here, and then uh, probably just throw a grenade in there. Take all those guys out. Pretty easy stuff. Yeah, just pick yourself up an M4, and uh, then you really won't have any kind of trouble. Here's the uh, little railroad signs I was talking about. Oh, <laughs> it almost got me there. That was closer, closer than I would have liked. But not really a huge deal. You can honestly just do this. Hang on to the side. In case you ever get into trouble. So, again, not really too difficult. 
Watch out for this one up here. Like, even if I get hit by one, I don't even think it's gonna matter. Like, seven minutes is a bit fortunate. Yeah, you also have the ones that come up this side uh, now, eventually. But as long as you uh, stay up top, those ones aren't going to hit you. Yeah, but like I was saying, this one doesn't really need a guide, but I just figured I'd do one because I did the other two. Alright, so yeah, I'm making pretty good time so far. I have some guys up here, but there's only three of them, and I take them out pretty easily. This is the part where the helicopter is going to come. Once you jump over here. Her plop. Oh, shit, what's that noise? Oh, no. But I found that during my uh, test run anyways. The helicopter literally is irrelevant. Like, you can just stand in the open and it's not going to hit you. So, not, not, really a, not really a big obstacle for you. Like, I'm literally just gonna run here and I'm not gonna get shot. Like, it, that fool's just sitting there not doing anything. Really just to focus on the actual guys. Just like that. And then, yeah, I mean, your biggest obstacle are these railroad crossing signs. You don't have to worry about anything else. Make sure you do go on the side of this uh, train car, though, because you have to do it at that part. And then, yeah, just uh, run, basically. We're almost at the end here, anyways. We have a few guys up here. Here we go. This is like the main part with guys, and there's not even a lot of guys, so. Yeah, I took them all out. And then pick up this RPG. I don't know if you have to do this, but. Shoot at the helicopter. Just do it for fun, if anything. So we've got a minute and 40 seconds left. We should be fine, though. I'm pretty sure we're almost at the end. You get to the end when you uh, make it to this tunnel. Yeah, this is the end. There's plenty of room to spare. And then just run a bit forward, and that'll be it. There you go guys, 5 minutes and 40 seconds, a minute and 20 seconds to spare. Um, that is Bullet Train from Hell, it's to beat Chapter 13, Locomotion, in less than 7 minutes. Out of all the three, it's definitely the easiest, which is probably why it's a bronze trophy. But really, uh, nothing nothing to this one compared to the other two, where there was some important parts you had to kind of watch out for. This one shouldn't cause you any trouble at all. But still, if this video helped you at all guys, be sure to leave a like, and as always, We'll see you guys soon.